This sprinkler video covers workspace queues, the rules engine, and how these work together along with account groups to power the dashboards you'll use to manage your accounts. When your unit is onboarded to Sprinkler, or when you add a new account group, you'll be given a templated dashboard. Some settings will need to be adjusted to accommodate your unit specific needs. Each unit has a set of workspace queues. These are lists of messages that come in through your accounts into the universal inbox and then can be processed and sorted into four other queues, no response required, in progress, hidden, and closed and responded to. You'll see these four columns on your processed dashboard. The universal inbox queue powers your inbound dashboard. When messages come in through your account groups, they run through a set of rules that sort out based on channel and message type and add the inbound messages to your universal inbox queue. The universal inbox queue is used to power your inbound dashboard. If you look at the settings for these columns, you'll see inbox queue and then your account group would go here. That filters the inbox queue list of messages to show messages from your specific account group if you have multiple account groups for your unit. For example, your universal inbox could be at the college level and an account group might be at the department or program level. The columns are further filtered by different message categories so that each column contains a specific type of message. In this case, inbound messages to the brand's Facebook page. When you receive a templated dashboard, there are a few columns you'll need to update manually. The Facebook external mention columns do not run off the universal inbox. They point to a specific page. So in this case, you'll need to go in to edit and choose your page from this account box. Remove the university page and add your own and then hit update. You'll do the same on both columns. The other update that must be done is updating the Twitter feed column. You'll hit edit select your account from the box here and hit update. All the other columns will automatically populate based on the account group, so it's very important that you accurately select your account groups when adding an account to Sprinkler in order for the messages to appear in your inbound columns.